Oh, here we go. That's pretty epic. $1.99, I think that is a great item. Army in Henderson, Nevada, and I haven't been here for a while, but we have to go kind of quick because my kids want to be picked up, and but mom has to make video, so <laughs> they have to wait, and I have to shop, and in we go. Okay, let's see what we can find here. That is a newer piece of crackle glass. Empty box. These guys are cute. But they're definitely new. Okay, okay that's very odd. <laughs> made in Taiwan. It's a fish plate. Are these, are these the spode? They are the spode. They have two actual place settings, but I don't see a price on any of there we go. So it's a five piece for ten dollars. And I'm kind of thinking that's that's worth getting, I think. Oh, what the heck. I'm gonna pick those up. Okay, let's see. Uh, it's an owl bell by Treasure Craft. It's a treasure craft owl bell. You know what? I don't normally pick up bells, but it's treasure craft. So I will pick it up. I know you guys always tell me, pull the little flap up if you're going to put the smalls up front. So there I am doing that. All right, this looks, looks like something. It's actually Linux. It's Linux. Oh, gosh darn. That's a bummer. All right, we'll leave it. All right. All right, we're gonna breeze through the Christmas. Because we just don't need any. Oops, we broke something in there. Robert Stanley. Now, Robert Stanley is actually a really good name. This says fall, but these look just really cheap. So, we are leaving them. It's a glitter bird. Oh, that wants to go with me for some reason. No. Stay, glitter bird. Stay. What's in here? Just a little mishmash of earrings. And don't see anything else that we would need to pick up. Alright, we might get through here pretty quick. What's on? The glasses side. What does this say? 
never drink and drive, just eat chocolate. Oh, here we go. That's pretty epic. $1.99, I think that is a great item for someone to buy as a gift. And there's a Tweety Bird. I don't know, is Tweety Bird still popular? I guess we're gonna find out for a buck ninety-nine. I will get Tweety Bird. Anything under here? I don't see anything. Hmm. Okay, anything in the dishes? These are kind of pretty. If I can get a hold of one. Black and gold. Don't know how old they are, but they're pretty worn. Oh. What are you, little atomic flower looking things? Oh, they're from the Wynn Encore. Look at that. They are just made to look vintage. Is this one? Okay, that's a pretty cool pattern. But unfortunately, you've only got just two pieces like that. Can't really do a whole lot with that unless you are crafty. And I am not crafty. All right. I don't see anything else. Okay, let's go here. You know, I see these a lot, these flattened bottles. I really don't think they sell for much. I could be wrong, but I will tell you when I edit this video. Okay. A little modern canister set. We got some coasters over here. Yeah. Nothing exciting except maybe this pottery bowl. It's got some weird marks on it though. It's kind of cool, but it's a little bigger than I want to deal with today. I actually think I might be okay with this song that's playing in the background because it is an old Christmas song and I'm pretty sure old Christmas songs have been released for many issues. So I'm going to talk as if I'm going to get to keep this part of the video in. This is a pretty little set of, um, this is flashed and I'll tell you, look, you can see, do you see all the like little scratching? And that's how you tell flashed. You can see the clear glass is either worn or scratched through the, the pink color. So it's $5.99, $5.99, that's a little too much. That's a cute little lusterware creamer, but unfortunately it does have a chip. But they price right when it has a chip. $0.99 cents is a good price for that. So. Oh, Ooh, there's a little carnage on the shelf right there. Pretty, but it's not a name. Wait. It's a turtle. Now, surprisingly, I'm not a sea turtle person. I mean, I love sea turtles, don't get me wrong, but I don't collect sea turtles because the turtles I collect represent my tortoises. So I'm actually a tortoise person because I love my torties. I kind of look through the art here. This is a, I forget that it's a very famous print. I mean, but this is a really cheaply done little thing, but I love the, just the very simple, the girl letting go of the balloon print. Hmm. Somebody painted a tiger. It's actually not done that bad, is it? It's on wood, and it's only 99 cents. We're going to get the tiger. Look under here, though. Let's 
Jesse. They're so cute, they're not Jesse. Is this yours? Yeah. Oh my God. All right. I'm kind of peeking under at the vases too. I don't see anything. This is a newer piece of, you can just look at, there's its tag right there. New carts of stuff. So we're just gonna take a peek. Oh, that's all chipped up. If that wasn't chipped, I would get that. These have a name on them. $5.99. It's transferware, but it looks newer. It does not have an old look or feel to it. Okay, I don't see anything exciting in there. Let's see if there's anything exciting in this one. It's a cup and saucer for $7.99. But they've covered up the mark. Hmm. I mean, there are some that are really good, but $7.99 is probably more than it should be. And then there's a jewelry box. Oh, there's another. There's another. Cup and saucer. This one is made in Staffordshire, England. Bow in China. Again, they're asking $7.99. Now, these are... I don't know who these are, but these are cute. Alright. Alright. It's a really pretty chair. It's newer with a newer fabric, and they want $25. Here. Let's see what they have. Nothing exciting. Big console bowl, but I don't think that's old. Nope, nothing exciting over here in the furniture. Okay, this is it. This is all I got here. I found a little something for Rachel, of course. And then the Tweety Bird and the Treasure Craft mug. And that's it. We're going to go check out. spent 30 bucks there and that's only because I let them round up I don't know I go back and forth on that but um, I did look up the Spode play settings and they sell for about $20 so I think what I'm gonna do is not sell them as a place setting I think I'm gonna sell the pair of plates the pair of mugs and saucers you know I'll pair them out because that way it goes for somebody who's looking for replacements versus uh, someone who's looking for an entire place setting, which probably is the lesser of the two. So there's that. Still making a profit, even though it's not as big as I would hope it would be. But then it is a little late in the season too. So, all right, I'm going to go hit one more store 
which you will not see in this video, but come back, subscribe, hit the notifications, and then when I put that video up, it'll let you know. So with that, go be profitable and make it fun, and we'll see you on the next one.